Good morning, my name is Nick Howerton. I work as the product marketing manager uh, for the, the combine and front-end marketing team at our Harvester Works factory in East Moline, Illinois. Today I'm happy to talk to you about the X9 combine that we've got behind us as well as the, the HDF uh, draper in front of us. So the X9 combine is the latest uh, uh, evolution in, in John Deere's harvesting solutions. Uh, we built upon the success of the X series and really enabled further capacity and efficiency. So with the X9 1100 behind us, we're going to be able to be 45% uh, uh, more capacity in beans and up to 50% more capacity in high moisture corn. Uh, and that's enabled through a number of things, including changes to uh, the, the rotor setup. We've grown to a two rotor setup, of course, uh, as well as widening the, the entire machine. Now in front of the machine, we've got our new, new for 22 HDF. So it's a hinge shaper with a flex knife. And again, like the HDR that was out for 2021, that goes from 35 to 50 feet. And this, uh, this head specifically is going to be a, a really good bean head. So it's got both the combination of the, of the wings for the contour following, as well as the flex knife to, to make sure you're getting low potting beans. So I think one is we're going to have, uh, we're going to have unparalleled levels of capacity in this machine. Uh, specifically, we've got the industry exclusive uh, HDF machine format. Nobody else has it in the marketplace. We've also got all the technology in the creature comforts that we've had in the S series for a long time. We brought those over. So we've got the premium cab with heated air conditioned seats with massage functions. So you've got a real environment that you want to be in for 14 hours a day. We've also got technology in the AI like we've had with Combine Advisor for several, several years in the S700 carried over to the X9. This machine is not for everyone. We're going to have to look at larger uh, scale farms, farms that are running either, either large machines today or several large machines today that, that have the yields and, and the field size to, to make this kind of machine make sense. You also got to think about the broader operational system. So if we're talking about 7,200 bushels an hour in corn or 30 acres an hour in beans or wheat, you got to get that crop off the field. So do you have the trucks lined up? Do you have the truck operators? Do you have the drying capacity? You have to think about all those operational decisions before uh, you can decide whether or not this machine would make sense for your operation. I think the one thing uh, we got to be clear on is uh, this is quite a step function change from the S series that we've had in the marketplace today. So we got to make sure that we're being very intentional about having those, those broader operational discussions with our customers to making sure they're considering all those factors. We also got to think about, about the washout cycle. That is going to change with this machine. We got to think about depreciation schedules. That will probably change with that machine. We'll have to see how those mature over time.